Alright, yo, what's up, boys? It's Mythic here, and I'm back with another like easy tutorial on this brand new yarn highlights text. Uh, it's an After Effects template, and it's very easy to use. And uh, yeah, let's get on with the video. Alright, so what you want to do is you want to go into the link in the description to the Google Drive folder and download the font and the After Effects template. And then once you've done that and you've got it on your desktop, you just want to load it. And just wait for it to load. Alright, so once you've once it's loaded up, you just want to ignore the empty text layers, and then you've got three layers. You've got your highlights, your create code, and your Twitter. So you just want to change the highlights to whatever highlights you're doing, and then you want to change that to. If you don't have a create code, you can just put something like ask for how much likes you want, and then here you can just put your Twitter at. Make sure you've got the so social circles font as well. You can find that on Daft font. It's that simple, and then. Once, once everything's your text, you just want to go File, Export, Add to Render Queue, and then you need to follow this carefully. So you want to press on Lossless, uh, Channels, RGB plus Alpha, and then where it says Color, straight on the um, brackets or matted, and then you just OK, and then you can pick, well, you can pick a place for you to store the file, save that, and then render it, and just wait for it to render it, and then I'll show you how to use it in Vegas. All right. Boys, so once you've loaded up uh, Sony Vegas and you've got your new text and you've got the clip that you want it to be over, you just want to import the clip and then you want to make a new video track above that and then import the text. So then once you've got the text, you just want to scroll down to where well, you want to right click, scroll down to properties, go on to media, alpha channel, straight in brackets or matted and then press OK. And then it's now above it. And yeah, you, I mean, you've basically got the text done, I could say. And then, I don't know, what, you, you can either have it over cinematics, or if you see Yarn, he's got it over the first clip, so yeah. Alright then boys, thanks for watching the video, hope it's been useful, hope you use it. And uh, yeah, if this video gets 1k views, then I'll make a full editing tutorial. Alright, see you in a bit.